Well, I tried to beat this guy a few times in my last playthrough. It didn't work out, so we're gonna try to do it again. Let's go. Why can't I block? Fuck, he just keeps... No, I really don't. Fucking difficult to keep track of what he's doing. Insanely difficult. Ah! 
Fuck. fire now? No. <laughs> oh my god, dude. Interfering in my life. I was just trying to protect you. I was. I've made mistakes. I know. But you're free now. You have what you want. Try to find forgiveness. We can build something new. <sighs>
But it's that alone will make you a whole. If seeing me dead will make things right, I won't stop. Every realm and feed your soul to the vilest filth in hell. That is my promise. He saved your life. He robbed me of everything. <laughs> everything. <laughs> you were just an animal. Passing on your cruelty and rage, you will never change! And you do not know me? I know enough. Does he? Boy! Listen close. I am from a land called Sparta. I made a deal with the god that cost me my soul. I killed many who were deserving. And many who were not. I killed my father. That was your father in hell. Is this what it is to be a god? Is this what it always ends? Sons killing their mothers? Their fathers? No. We will be the gods we choose to be. Not those who have been. Who I was is not who you be. We must be better. Well, guess we are the bad guys now. In her eyes, yes. But she could never make that choice. this journey while I still have strength. I don't understand. I know saving her was the right thing. But she seemed all evil at the end. Not evil. You killed her son, lad. Her son. The death of a child is not something a parent gets over easily. 
but he was yeah. gonna kill her. She would have died to see him live. Only a parrot can understand. So you'd let me kill you? If it meant you would live. Yes. Look, there was no easy choice. For anybody, brother. But I think we can all agree you did the right thing. The world's a better place with Freya in it. Just give her time, lads. She'll come around. Back to Tyr's temple, then. One last time. Aye. Jotunheim awaits. All right, that was a wild episode. Odin must have convinced him that following you to Jotunheim would bring us. All right, all right, all right. We're cutting this off. That was a wild episode, and I don't want to go. I don't want to add on to that episode. That episode deserves to be what it was by itself, with nothing else. So I'll see you. In the, I'll see you in the next one. Thank you guys for watching. I appreciate it. Peace. All right, everybody, welcome back to God of War, part number 30, what is this, 32? It's getting up there, or 33, actually, because uh, last one was 30, holy shit, it's part number 33 of God of War. All right, well, let's get right back oh, into it. Lies, I'm sure. Why did Mistletoe break the spell? Vanier magic is powerful, but its rules are slippery and elusive. I'm sure it makes sense if you're a witch. Oh, but it's also bloody tragic. Balder was the greatest gift Odin granted Freya. The one thing she treasured from their marriage. She only hoped to spare him pain and spare herself loss. But such impulses can lead good parents to make terribly stupid decisions. So... Ah, we'll go on a boat. Get some stories going. Tell a story, Ed. Atris, tell a story. Somebody. Come here. Why did you say Tyr felt responsible for what Odin did to the giants? There was an incident shortly after the forging of Mjolnir, when Tyr arranged a diplomatic meeting between Odin and the giant kings. Well, this was when the Long War was young, when victory was still a thing dreamed of, and the Jotnar might have tipped the balance between Aesir and Vanir. Odin had persuaded Tyr that the hammer was merely a deterrent, a means to broker peace from a position of strength. Tyr was hopeful to convince all parties they would prosper best through peace. He knew the giants were deeply concerned about the hammer, a super weapon in hands they did not trust. But they trusted Tyr. Tyr always believed the best in people, and taking Odin at his word in his desire for peace, he brought the Raven King to Jotunheim. From there, things unraveled quickly. The giants anticipated Odin's trickery and exposed his true agenda to spy and steal their secret wisdom. With magics, they expelled Odin from their realm and cursed him never to return. Frustrated, Odin visited his fury upon the giants of Midgard. Thor unleashed Mjolnir's might upon any giant he could find. None could stand against the tide of slaughter that followed. And at last, it seems, with Tyr's aid, they retreated. The tower disappeared, no giants could be found in Midgard, and no man nor god has set foot in Jotunheim since. All right. Well, that was a story. Let's go. Hey, Frey is a witch, and if Frey is a witch, can't I don't know how this works, but can't she just bring Baldur back to life? Okay, that's just something that kind of hit me. You two going in or what? All right, what'd you break? 
Uh, I still can't get any of this stuff, and I really want it. Another time, man. <sighs> Come on. Here we go. I can't believe we're gonna see the giants. Well, if things work according to plan, <clears throat> go ahead and lock in Jotunheim, and we'll be on our way. There we go. Boy, go ahead. Get ready. Oh, right. Got it. Let's hope this doesn't cause you to explode or anything. Oh, hadn't considered that. Maybe we should talk about this a bit more. Nah, I'm sure you'll be fine. Ready? Unpoisoned. Now, boy. Oh, my God. Damn, dude. She's still alive. Close. All right, there you well, go. What are we waiting for? He's blinking. We will see. A word, please, before we continue. Listen, the last thing you two need up there is a decomposing heat ruin in the moment. Why don't I wait for you here? This is between you and the boy. True. But if someone were to fight... My lady sifts soft, perfect sloshers. You done did it. Sorry. We had to see this. <laughs> oh, no. No, 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 no. What? No. Fine, damn it. Fine. Watch the head till we return. I can do this. No, no, I can't. Oh. Okay. Ready. Come. Without the head, who's going to provide comic relief? Oh, man. Go, boy. Dude, why is the trace running so fast? I can't... Oh. Oh, jeez. Look! We're on the giant's fingers. I can see the highest peak ahead. Right over there. We did it. We did. What are you doing? What is he? Nothing more to hide. Can we go now? We're so close. Boy. Oh, 
Oh, that's nice. That was really nice. Hmm. Boy. It's nothing. I just thought I'd hear voices by now. Quit running so fast, I can't catch up to you. Hello? Anybody here? What is this place? They must have all come through here when they left Midgar. What was left of them. Why carve all these faces? What if this is all the giants that got out of Midgard alive? Not really many at all. Odin and Thor ruining everything for everybody. What's this? Where are they now? The giants came back home so they could survive. But I'm not sure they did. I should feel them, but I don't. This place is dead. What happened to them? Why'd Mom send us here? One question is answered, and two more take its place. Oh! Hey, father! Something's happening! Holy Look. shit. She's arguing with a bunch of giants. She knew giants? That's us. The first time we met the world serpent. But how? And our fight with Balder. But that just happened. Wait. Holy crap. They knew everything that was going to happen. The dragon in the mountain. The stone mason. All these drawings. This is our story. No. This is your story. Ooh. But. What does it all mean? That I was not the only parent with secrets. You didn't know. She was a giant. Holy shit. I'm a giant. Why didn't she tell us? She sent us here, knowing we would find this. But... Why not just tell us the truth? Her mother would have had good reasons. Balder was never sent to find me. He was tracking her all along. Not knowing she was only ashes. If she had a plan for us... <laughs> I trust it. Whatever it is. Besides, she hasn't been wrong yet. Come on. We're so close to the end now. That little dude is a giant. Yes. Yes, we are. Wow. 
Wait, what was that? What was that? I don't think I under I don't think I fully understood that. Is he gonna kill us? Is he gonna kill Kratos? Oh, I don't know about this. Look, it's mother's. She was here. She saw every step we took before we took it. Like she was always with us. Watching over us. Leading us home. Let's finish it. Are you good? I'm not talking much this episode because I don't want to ruin anything, man. Music's giving me chills, dude. Giants. They really are all gone. There's nothing for us here. Come. So, I get that mother was a giant, which makes me part giant and part god. And part mortal. Right. I guess there's just one thing I don't understand. My name on the wall. The giants called me... Loki? Ooh. Loki. That's the name your mother wanted for you when you were born. She must have called you that to her people. But why? Question for another day. Let us go home. Hmm, okay. Way to avoid that, Kratos. It's the end of the game. Did she know it was going to be like this here? Is this what she wanted? Or the end of the story, I should she say. Did she want us to tell the people? Or keep it a secret? I do not know. So what should we do? I trust you to decide that. Oh. Why'd you want to name me Atreus? 
I know it can't be for a god. <laughs> no. He was a soldier. A Spartan. A great warrior? All Spartans are great warriors. We train from birth. Our lives were discipline, duty, battle, and death. Life was grim, and we greeted it grimly. Hmm. But Atreus of Sparta was unlike the rest of us. He wore a smile even in the worst of times. He was happy. He inspired us to hope that though we were machines of war, yet there was humanity in us. Goodness. When the day came for him to lay down his life in battle, his sacrifice saved countless others and turned the tide in our favor. I carried him home on his shield and buried him with all the honors of Spartan custom. His memory was a comfort in dark times. Wow, you actually told a good story. We are missed it. <laughs> Dude, this game was amazing. I understand if you want to go home. I bet there are still some corrupt developers out there that could be set free. Some other help people. Maybe helping people is part of why mom sent us out here, too. Exactly. I mean, what would Atreus of Sparta do? And what would Loki do? Huh. That's a weird name. I'm glad we went with yours. I know nothing of this mythology, like Norse mythology, or Greek mythology, really, for that matter. But I know Loki is a god, isn't he? Lads, am I glad to see you? What happened? I reached my limit for dwarven charm. What happened, Lemire? They took an uncomfortable number of measurements and then proceeded to bicker about the weather. Where do you want us to take you? How about the warm confines of anywhere bloody else? Huh. Free dragons tro Oh, this game is amazing. There's so much more to do. But that was it for the story, you guys. Oh my god, I love this. this. This was the best, other than The Last of Us, this was the best PlayStation game I've ever played. I've never played a game as good as this. I, I don't know where to begin. I can't even give up. I can't even give a proper review because my head is like my mind's just going about everything that happened in this game i don't know i might give a review whenever i have time to to like uh process all of it but all i can say is this game 11 out of 10 for this game 100 out of 10 they nailed every aspect of the story they from start to finish middle like everything they nailed I, uh, the characters, the emotions, uh, they nailed everything. Um, I don't know what else to say really, but that that was God of War. And I'm so glad that this was the first God of War I ever played. I don't know if I'll go back and play all the other God of Wars because they don't look like my kind of thing. They, I don't like, I like the the dynamic with this one the camera always follows you at this distance I don't like the camera being f pulled far out and the action taking place way in front of it I don't really like that camera angle I might try it though just to you know give it a try but uh I, I don't I'm just so glad I got this game I'm so glad I played it I'm so glad I gave it a chance I I, I, I love it and for anyone who watched, I know it wasn't many people probably, but for anyone who watched, thank you for watching. I really appreciate it. I love each and every one of you. And I'll see you in my next videos. All right.